gun. You jump in the gun. You're, you're testing stuff before we video. Should we open it? You already opened it. That's okay. the problem. Okay. Oh, come on, there's my light. Okay, so you're over here playing with it now. What did right. you find out already? Okay, so we found out that it doesn't work on its own. It doesn't work. Okay, we, we need... found that out. Okay, we first need... we got to show what it is. It is um, one of these. A BT300P battery tester from Top Down. These are the guys that did the big heavy duty jump starter we did. What did I drop? No, that was your belt. Yeah, we don't care about your paperwork. Top secret. All right, so it comes this nice package. It's got really nice instructions here that we didn't really look at. And then it's got paper tape in here, so it prints out. What is it? So it's for shop. Is this a shop? This is a shop. Okay, so there you go. This is a shop. I come the lights on. There it so is. So we're here. On. Is this a good battery or a bad one? I uh, don't know. We're gonna That's find what we need a tool for. We're going to find out. All right, so the machine turns on. Yeah, it says a BTS. tells you what it is right there. Look at that. Except I can't see it. Yeah. Battery test, Turn the cranking on. test, charging test, and review data. We won't mess with the language because that's what we need. All right, okay, we're going to do the battery test. Enter. Reflection's bad around here. There we go. There, I can see it better there. <clears throat> Except I can't read it. Regular flooded, AGM, GEL, or EFB. This is a blue top. This doesn't work too good for what we're doing. Uh, Blue top. That's a marine battery. AGM. I don't know. It should automatically tell you what it is, doesn't it? Well, you got to tell it what it is. Yeah. You can't just it's, plug gotta and play. It. We got to tell it what it is. And this is, I know it's a gel battery. It's a spiral gel. Yep. It's Ultima. Spiral cell technology. There you go. Ultimate power cell. Spiral cell. So I guess it's just AGM. It's an AGM. Enter. Cold cranking apps. Enter our 750. So you we gotta the put off. the arrow here. That's the problem. I think your lights doing the video. Oh crap. Okay, Let's stop crap. the video. Okay. Okay, he can go play. What do we got over here? Yeah, now I can see what's going on. <clears throat> now what do you do? I don't know. Get enter. Power too low. Whether to continue testing. Yes, I want to continue testing. What do we care if the battery's low? That's why we're testing it. Jeez, what kind of stupid thing is this? <clears throat> Health, 0%. Charge rate, 11.99 volt. That means it's bad. Rated crank amp is 585. How does it know that? We have 31 cranking amps. Okay, that's not good. 31 out of 585 is bad. Yeah. Let well, me we test the Cadillac. That one just started. Well, you're dangerous over there. You ever heard of a break? <laughs> okay, this one only got 31 cranking amps. Huh? This only got 31 cranking amps. It's only got 31 cranking apps? Yeah, it says the battery's in dead state of discharge. It's 11.99 volt. Okay. It said it didn't have enough power to test. Okay. It's supposed to be 585 cranking amps, and it's got 31. I don't know if you can read this right. Actually, it's rated at 750 cranking amps. No, it says right here 585. Hey, this thing knows everything. Yeah, well, <laughs> I don't know about all that. I did, yes. I did put, well, actually, no, that's because we had to stop. We stopped. Yeah. So let's exit. Hold well, on. I continued, though. Oh. The battery's dead. Go test that cat over there. It looks like a nice cat. What year is that thing? 70-something? 70, 70. 70. 70 cat. All right. How's the battery? It started, so it must be good. This Work. one is 850 cranking apps. 850. Ooh. And it is not a gel. Well, this is a flooded acid. This is flooded acid. I mean, it's big and heavy. Flooded acid. BT battery test. Enter. Oh, wait. Yeah. Enter. And this is a regular flooded. Enter. Cold cranking apps. Enter. They are 850. Oh, look at that. <clears throat> Tell what it is. Boom, close 850, enough. enter, testing. Looks like you used these kind of tools before. Sir, yes, sir. It's a nice tool. 
good battery health at 74 percent that's not good charge is 90 percent what's the voltage 12.54 yeah, that's what 12.54 well it's been sitting here for about a week it's been sitting for a week. There we go. so it Tested at 732 cranking amps. Mm -hmm. Not bad. So now you print out your ticker tape and sell them a new battery because it's, it's only got 75% usage. That's print. Holy moly. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Look what we got there. Yeah, fancy, fancy, fancy. Okay, and you take that, you put it on his windshield. And he knows he's got a, he needs a new battery because it's only got 75%. Even though it says good battery? No, it's got 75%. <laughs> well, what do you mean it's got a good battery? We're going to sell him a battery because it says good battery? 74%. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. We're going to sell him it. It says good battery right on top, and we're going to sell him a battery, huh? Okay. No, we're going to show him the 74%. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll just put that there, and we'll just say we did a free test. We did a free test. That's a really nice piece of machine there. That battery over there is a piece of crap. Well, it needs to be charged. It does need to be charged. It said that. It needs to be charged. Okay, so what's the rating on a tool, one to 10? I'm gonna give it a 10. A 10? I'm gonna Jeez. give it a 10. That's a hard test It was easy to use. It was quick. The input was easy. The print was single button, single action. And the customer has a copy. You don't even have to tell them how and bad it is. And I don't even have is. to tell them. It's all telltale on the receipt. Yeah, just... It identifies the type of battery, the state of charge, its condition. I'll give it a 10. 10 yeah. out of 10. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Yeah, I think I didn't do too good on this. Top done. Top huh? done is working. Top done is working. So the, the jump starter worked nice and the battery tester worked nice. Yeah. So, so far we got good products from these people. Yeah. Good stuff. And handheld, very easy to use. And uh, what kind of a series number is this thing? Oh, the light came on. Oh, there's all your info. All right, so we like it. I like it. Ten out of ten. Does it work? Does this have a hundred cold cranking up on this bike? We can test it. You can't get to the battery. Oh, it's a lousy bike. So it comes in this nice carrying case right here. Oh, it's got a name on it and everything. Well, yeah. Hey, this is not recyclable. You can't recycle this. The box or the unit? Uh, I thought the box. The box. <laughs> the box. Okay, we got one more test. All right. Let's see how fast it goes in the bag. Oh, that's not a good test. Because that is actually something that is important to oh, me. Because we charge by the hour around here. Because huh? uh, if it's one of those things that come out but never go back in easy, I'm not interested. Uh, the secret is to take the paper out. No, the secret is slide over the paper. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah. And so I never, I never took that you out. You didn't even disconnect it. Oh my God! And look at that. You're saving time Seconds. already. Seconds. Look at that. Do you like it? You got a nice this zipper. is the top dawn. You like it? In the box, 45 seconds. Bam, bam. Thank, Thank you, ma'am. Ma look you at that. You're good to go. Look so, at that. So you're happy now? Still 10, 10. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Can't get better than that. Nope. Okay. There you go.